Hello, my name is Jennifer Keithley, and I'm a physician assistant student at the University of Maryland Eastern Shore, and I'm also a part of AHAC. I decided to join this program because I liked the idea of being able to expand my knowledge outside of the program that I'm currently in, um, as well as being able to increase the network that I have by connecting with other students at AHAC and also healthcare professionals that are already practicing. Hi, I'm Brent Hurt, and I'm a fourth year medical student at the University of Maryland in Baltimore. I'm currently in my second year of the AHAC Scholars Program. I joined AHEC Scholars because I wanted to gain exposure to a different side of medicine that I couldn't obtain by just staying in one location, such as the big city where my medical school is. To become a more versatile physician, I wanted to gain first-hand experience working with patients in an underserved rural community. Healthcare resources including specialists, uh, social services, and equipment can vary greatly between urban and rural settings. If, even if you decide to only work your whole career in one of those settings, you're gonna be working with providers who live in the other settings. So it's important to know what resources they have available to them. The AHEX program also promotes uh, opportunities to meet these students that are working in those areas or other fields of medicine by hosting multiple opportunities for making friends or just collaborating with uh, students from other healthcare fields on different projects. So knowing what resources are available to the other providers based on their prof profession, uh, the location that they're in and their level of training is really great training for helping you learn how to coordinate feasible care plans um, that are specific to each patient's needs in the future. Hello, my name is Ambly George. I'm a final year nurse practitioner student here at University of Maryland, Baltimore. And also I'm in my second year of AHSC scholar program. Before I started this program in 2019, I did not have any idea about what a AHSC scholar program is. Thus, in fact, one of my professors actually introduced us to this program by sharing all the wonderful experience she had as an AHSC scholar at Eastern Shore, Maryland. Growing up in a remote village in India, I always knew the struggles of people who live in remote area to obtain their health care needs. It's always my dream to be a family nurse practitioner who provide care to the rural population as well as the underserved population. Good morning, my name is Katherine Hamer and I am a physician assistant student at Frostburg State University as well as a second year uh, AHEC scholar. Um, so as I began my education in physician assistant school, I knew that I wanted to help in and serve rural and underserved communities. However, to be able to do this successfully, I felt as though I needed to be a resourceful clinician as well as knowledgeable about what my patients needed. It's been extremely beneficial because a lot of the didactic hours um, consist of different lectures that can help me in the future. Things such as um, COVID-19 updates, when to refer to a patient to a specialist, um, race within healthcare, ethical issues, and so much more. Um, and these are all things I already learned within my program, but it's been nice to be able to hear people with knowledge and experience and what they have to say. So AHEC Scholars has served as an excellent supplement to my medical training. In addition to the immersive experiences working in underserved health communities, the didactic component of the program has helped me gain a greater understanding of the ongoing and upcoming issues in healthcare provision. I also appreciated that the program lets students select from a wide variety of topics to complete this didactic component, allowing people to pursue their personal interests. For example, I did prior research related to the opioid epidemic, um, through this program, I was able to get credit by completing a prescription waiver course for naloxone and also listening to lectures exploring other approaches and alternatives to treating opioid use disorder in patients. I see this AHC Scholar program as a first step to my future journey. I encourage all the healthcare field students, be it medicine, nursing, nurse practitioner, physical, physician assistant, physical therapy. I encourage you to experience this wonderful program. I assure you will like it. While my program at Frostburg State excels at preparing students for this, I felt as though AHEC Scholars was another opportunity to help me on this journey that I just could not pass up.
To students that are looking forward to and want to join AHEC, um, I would say that they should take on any different opportunity that they may come their way, even if they don't seem like it's something they would be interested in, because um, I believe that it's something that can help them in the future. Um, and they may come to like uh, that topic, whether they thought they would or not. So my advice would be that even though pre-professional -pre school can get very busy already, I want to let prospective students know that this program is totally doable alongside your school curriculum. This program has enough content to ensure that you're going to gain valuable knowledge for collaborating with interprofessional colleagues and treating underserved populations, but it never interfered with my main medical school curriculum. Most of the didactics are flexible and virtual experiences that you can do at your own convenience. For the immersive rotations in underserved areas, the AHEC program staff has been great in coordinating with my school to ensure that I've received dual program and school credits for all of these rotations. As an AHC scholar, I worked in an urgent care at Eastern Shore, and that was the meaningful learning experience I had as a nurse practitioner student. I would say that uh, future clinicians should join the AHEC Scholars Program because of the wide variety of learning opportunities it presents you with. It has shown me what kind of medicine is important to me and what kind of clinician I want to be. The AHEC Scholars Program has also been beneficial to my educational journey because it connects me to webinars and activities that help me address um, popular medical topics as well as the social determinants of health um, that are so important when treating rural and underserved populations. I was able to do a meaningful experience through AHEC, which uh, back in September, I was able to participate in a virtual COVID-19 workshop, and this was for local high school students. Um, myself and other fellow AHEC scholars made a presentation and we were able to share with the students um, different things about COVID, like symptoms, testing, vaccine information, quarantine protocol and I, it was really nice because um, even though it was a virtual presentation it was nice to know that we were able to be able to get out to the community and um, share our knowledge and what we had to say. My most meaningful experience in the AHEC Scholars Program has been working with a rural primary care physician, Dr. Ryder, on the eastern shore of Maryland. My initial experiences in a primary care clinic came at my school in uh, the city where it was very different because I was at a large academic center with a specialist for every condition literally a block away. Referrals were a lot easier to coordinate. The Eastern Shore has a significantly less concentration of specialists in the area, which means patients are either going to have to travel a long distance to find someone who performs a certain procedure, or if there is a local specialist in the area, they're usually pretty booked up, meaning it will take a long time before the patient can get in to see them. Uh, my preceptor acknowledged this fact, and taught me a lot about how to navigate the issue and ensure that the patients had enough medications to bridge them until they could reach that appointment. I now feel a lot more comfortable making creative care plans that can bridge and safely monitor the patient until they can be seen by the proper specialist or subsequent care. I've enjoyed my time in AHEC Scholars and learned a lot about the social obstacles to healthcare beyond the basic requirements for my medical school training program. I highly recommend this trip program to any healthcare students. If you give me an opportunity to be an AHS scholar again, yes, sure, I'll do it. Thank you. One of my more uh, meaningful experiences through the AHEC Scholars Program was actually um, the way that they were able to provide housing for me in Cumberland, Maryland, um, as well as being so practical and helpful to me while I wanted to serve um, these rural communities it was also an amazing experience because I was able to um, stay in this housing with other students from other professions, which was awesome because I got to learn a little bit more about um, their professions as well as their goals for the community. I hope that you consider joining AHEC and taking advantage of all the opportunities that it has for you, and we look forward to working with you.